Welcome back to Window in Thailand, the Anaman. We're going to talk more about sailing as another tourism option with Mr. Gulavani, and we're going to go check out his new yacht, Mangusta, that just arrived from Europe. Shall we go? Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. I'll lead the way in. Thank you. Hello. Hello. I'm Abel. Captain Arno. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Arno. And we go far. So he's going to take us a little cruising around. Excellent. Excellent. Yes. I'm excited. to qualify to uh, sail a boat like this? This is quite a complex boat, so I sent the captain to the shipyard when it was being built for about three months to pick up all the controls. And uh, I called the name of the boat Happy. Happy? I like to be happy. I uh -huh. want all my guests to be happy. Mm. So this yacht is called Happy. Well, that's great. Yeah. Usually it's called like seduction or yeah. like... <laughs> no, this one is all happy. So let, me, <laughs> let me take you. I'm downstairs. happy to be here. <laughs> so now we're going down to the second floor. What do you call this? This is all the way the master cabin and master cabin and guest. Make it for you. And yeah, this is where you keep all your cutlery, crockery. Wow. Everything stored here. So even have? when the board is going, the way it's fitted out. Even when the boat is going at full speed, it doesn't damage anything, you know, it's all right. very it's all well. It's fitted very tightly. Yeah, very, very perfectly fitted. Thank you. This is really beautiful. My first time on such a beautiful boat. So what can you do on a yacht? I mean, oh I'm God. relaxing now, but... <laughs> oh my God. There's endless things you can do, virtually everything, you know. If you're with a woman you love and care for, it's endless. You can go to beautiful islands, sunset, mm -hmm. our beautiful by the beach, you can go snorkeling. Many places go to, to, to go to beaches, in Phuket. make love under the stars, <laughs> and nobody, you get all the privacy. I mean, being on a boat or a yacht with people you care for, mm -hmm. friends, families, loved ones. Right. I don't think there's anything better in the world. That's why I have five boats wow. of different sizes from 10 meters, 30 meters, and, and I enjoy them all, you know, on different times, depending on the mood. So let's so. say you do a party. How many people can actually fit into, let's say, this one? And this one for a party you can have about 20 people. 20 people? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Inside, some are in, some in the front, some in the back. And uh, this goes very fast. Uh, from here to Langkawi in Malaysia, I do it in two hours. It goes over 40 knots an hour. Uh -huh. So. so it's, uh, I know this is a marina and it docks a lot of yachts and things like that, but do you actually have yachts that people can rent here, especially for like lower yes, budget? Yes, for luxury, there are boats, people, yachts people can rent here, which cost, say, between six to ten thousand dollars a day. Six to ten thousand dollars a day? Six dollars a day. Okay. And then you have your total privacy. On the other hand, right. you can also go on the boat for $100 a day, as I told you before, which includes lunch, that includes picking up at your hotel and dropping you off 
at the end of the day. Okay. All for hundred dollars. But then you go on a tour board that you see as well on the marina. But if you want to go on a private yacht, then it starts from six thousand a day upwards. Okay. Six thousand like, US a day, that is yeah. about how many bots? Six times three. Uh, two hundred thousand bots. Twenty thousand bots. Two hundred thousand. Two hundred thousand. Two hundred thousand. And yeah. that includes food, gas, all of that, yes. right? Yes. Yes. That includes. Okay. Food and. And captain as well. And the captain. And crew. The captain and the crew. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. okay. Yeah. Well, that 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 that's okay. Yeah. Much be easier for me to understand. Yeah. For a luxury yacht. Um. Let's say. Uh. I want to stay on my own boats. Do I need a driver license or I mean like a sailing license? How does that work? No. If you go out in the sea, then you need a little bit of training like you do with the car. Okay. And in a week or 10 days, you can pick it up. That's but, it? But yeah, in a week or 10 days, uh, on a small boat. Oh, okay. A boat up to 10 meters. Right. You can do that. But when it comes to bigger boats, then you need a crew. But here you can get local captains for reasonable price compared to elsewhere in the world, you know, so. Okay, uh, okay. So, in the ocean, for, for me, who have never sailed before or never driven a boat before, can you give me some idea of, like, what is the rules and, you know, regulations when you are sailing in the Phuket Ocean, in the Anaman Sea? I think my recommendation to a new person who's going to start boating as a hobby, mm -hmm. he should have a captain or charter a boat so you would suggest that you always get a captain because they already yeah. understand the rules and the regulations. Yeah, yeah. for safety. You just and come so and have fun, yeah. enjoy snorkeling, yeah. go to the islands and do whatever you much want to better. do in the privacy of your own boat. Much better, much better. Much better. Can you sail at yeah, night? People do. Some yes. people do sail at night. Is there different rules for sailing at night yes. in the morning? I don't like sailing at night, mm -hmm. but there are people who go around the world from one island to another. They're sailing 24 hours. Yes, I find that a bit wow. dangerous. But those who are used to it, and today with all the latest instruments and GPSs and so on, they guide you. So Gulu, tell me, what do you think is the best feature at Royal Pukin Marina? There are many great features, but one that I love the most, personally, is it's the only marina in Thailand mm -hmm. where you can bring your boat right next to your villa. So when you feel like going out, you just go out, come as we did today, mm -hmm. and come back from a day's cruising. You go straight to your home and have a shower. Right. You jump in the pool or... Very convenient. Well, you're very convenient. So we're now going to take a short break, Gulu. And for you, please don't go away just yet. We're going to come back and talk more about tourism and business outlook for years to come as well as visit his villa.